Hi guys, and welcome back to The Family Fudge. Today I'm heading into the Dollar Tree, so come along with me. Now I was actually here last night about five minutes before closing. I ran in just for one thing that I needed for an organizing project, and I realized that this Dollar Tree has a lot of new items. So come along with me into the store today. I'll show you all the new items, and then after I'll show you what I ended up getting. So let's go. Now at my Dollar Tree, right when you walk in the door is where they usually put the new seasonal items. So today that was bonus buy items, flowers, lots of flowers, and new organizing bins and baskets. They did also have a lot of summer items and graduation things as well. But what I really wanted to check out was the bonus buy section. Here you can find some of the Dollar Tree's most popular items, but instead of just getting one or two, they put an extra one in the package, so it's a great time to stock up. They had lots of these little organizing baskets. These are great for pantries and for drawers. And right now, instead of getting two, you get three for a dollar. I was really excited to see these little snack containers. I use these all the time in my lunches and they work really well. And the same goes for these little snack containers as well. They have some rectangle ones and some round ones. I use these all the time and now you get 12 instead of just 10. They also had the Dollar Tree version of a magic eraser. Now you get three, and now you get an extra microfiber towel, which is really nice. Next to the bonus buy area, they also had a lot of new storage bins. They had these small plastic ones with lids in really fun colors, and the collapsible storage containers as well, also in lots of different colors. Now moving on to the flower section, I wasn't kidding when I said they had a ton. They actually had flowers in several different parts of the store, on different aisles and on end caps, just so many beautiful flowers. I was especially drawn to the new peony ones that they had. They came in two different shades of pink and white and they were really big, very nice for just a dollar. Next to the flowers, they had all of these new bins and baskets in these fun colors. There was pink, green, red, and teal. And in each of the colors, you could find paper holders, drink pitchers, and they had these new, more sturdy baskets. I really like these ones. They have all different shapes and sizes. And they also had all of the other traditional bins and baskets in these really fun new colors. I found new kitchenware in a fun, beautiful new pattern. I love this blue paisley design. You could find plates and oven mitts, placemats, cups, and bowls. All of it was really pretty. Oh yes, and they had chargers, these beautiful silver chargers. I was looking for these everywhere around Christmas time and I could never find them. So that was pretty much all of the new items that I noticed, but I also noticed they restocked some of my favorite items in the other areas, like the metal buckets in the garden section, these are so pretty. I also checked the regular storage area. They had just restocked all of their baskets and bins, so I definitely wanted to stock up on those. I also needed some things for painting projects coming up, so I checked out the hardware and the automotive section. And just for fun, I checked out the home decor and candle area as well, but I didn't really see many new things in that section. Okay friends, I'm back from the Dollar Tree and I have to say I did pretty well today. I did not go overboard. Sometimes I end up with too much home decor that I don't really need, but I didn't do that today. It was sort of practical, but I'll go ahead and show you my favorite item first, and it's these beautiful peonies. They had so, so many flowers at the Dollar Tree. And in fact, while I was there, I took a little flower wall selfie. Have you guys seen those at Hobby Lobby? They're so fun. But anyway, I picked up four, no, five, no, four. I picked up four of these guys and they had these in pink as well. But I just love the classic white color and these are so big and such high quality for just a dollar. These are awesome. And I can pretty much stick these in any vase and it's gonna look beautiful. Aren't those awesome? I think I want to go back and get more. Next up, I have two new cleaning products I've never seen before. These are the multi-purpose cleaning cloths, and you actually get two of them in a pack for a dollar. These are perfect for wood, glass, leather, electronics, in your car. You can use them wet or dry. 
and they're more eco-friendly. So I think these, these feel like they're gonna do a really good job at cleaning, so we shall see. Next, I got several different kinds of shelf liners. First, I have this adhesive kind. I like to put this in my drawers um, so it doesn't move around. And it has this really pretty pattern with the gray color, which I love. So I got three of those. And then I also got this kind of shelf liner. I like to put this on my shelves where I put my plates and my cups and things like that. So I'm definitely gonna be putting these in my kitchen sometime soon. Can you guys tell that I'm on a reorganizing kick right now? I totally am. I'm trying to go through every cupboard and every drawer in the entire house and just get rid of things I don't need and reorganize what I want to keep. So I got lots of these bins. Dollar Tree has so many right now and they have a lot of pretty colors as well, but I tend to go for the more neutral and bright white and tan ones. They're just my favorite. I think they look clean and crisp. So first off, I have two of this size and what's really interesting is now, well, in my Dollar Tree, now they offer a lid that comes with it for a dollar. Now these lids don't actually snap into place, so it can totally just fall off. But what is really cool about it is that you can now stack things. So if I can put this right there, I can stack that on top, whereas I couldn't really do that before. So I've got two of those. I also got one of this sort of longer, taller size and two of these more shallow kind. And I actually organize these with these all over the house. I actually have some in my fridge. I have one for uh, string cheese and one for yogurt tubes and they work perfect in the fridge. And these are very much like the kind you might find at Target but they're a lot more expensive. These are pretty sturdy, I love these guys. Then I also got lots of these little utensil trays. I have a lot of small drawers in my kitchen that won't fit a standard utensil organizer. So these things are perfect because you get to choose the configuration. You can have it however you want. So I got six of the smaller kind and I got three of the longer kind. And these are also really heavy duty, nicely made. And here's a trick you guys, once you put them in your drawer, if you're worried about them moving around when you open the drawer, you can get some poster tack and actually put it on the bottom and stick it down in your drawer. It's not going to damage your drawer. They even sell poster tack at the Dollar Tree so you can pick it up while you're there. And then when you open the drawer, these won't move around. I almost forgot to show you, I also got two of this size. This one is a little bit more shallow, but wider. Now I also got lots of painting supplies. I don't buy my painting supplies anywhere else these days because I like to just spend a dollar if I can. So I got this little paint cup. This is great for when you're painting up high, you're painting trim and you wanna take it with you. And I also got two rollers. Now these aren't the best rollers, but you know, rollers are disposable. I don't usually wash mine out and reuse them. So I like to pay just a dollar. I also got a frame and a drop cloth, and finally this little paint tray. I'm pretty sure the next room I'm going to be painting is my boy's bedroom. I'm hoping to do a makeover in there. And of course, I'm hoping to share it with you guys. I also stocked up on my command hooks. I love these guys, especially from the Dollar Tree. You can actually get smaller ones. This comes with two for a dollar, and you can get larger ones. And I use these everywhere. And they really do work, you guys. You can remove them and it doesn't damage your wall or whatever it's attached to. Now I do have to say that Dollar Tree makes their own brand um, that, are, that are pretty similar, but for me, I could never get them to work quite as well as these ones. So I like to stick with a name brand when I'm there. Next up, I have some containers. These are perfect for snacks. You guys know I love to make school lunches and I love to use really cute containers. And I actually bought a lot of containers on my last Dollar Tree haul. So I just picked up these red ones because they didn't have any red ones. And right now, this is a bonus buy. So instead of getting two for a dollar, you get three. Also from the bonus buy section, I picked up these magic erasers or <laughs> actually quick erasers, but you get what I mean. So yes, you get three now instead of two, which is awesome. And I don't buy these as often as I used to. Um, I started using microfiber cloths and they work so well, but there are certain jobs where I just want one of these more disposable erasers. And speaking of microfiber cloths, I also got this guy. This is actually a wash mitt from the automotive section, but I'm gonna use this all over the house to dust things like ceiling fans and shelves. These really do work so well and they're washable. So you just wash it and reuse it, which I really like. 
I also stocked up on my tape. We were totally out and I really needed some the other day. So I went ahead and picked up four rolls while I was there. And lastly, I just picked up this really cute board book. This will be great for my kindergartner, but also my toddler as well. It's <laughs> nice and sturdy. And this is full of Mother Goose um, rhymes. Just the classic Hey Diddle Diddle and Mary Had a Little Lamb and things like that. We're going on a road trip, so I'm stocking up on my activities to keep them busy. Now that is everything in my Dollar Tree haul for April. I think I'm most excited about these beautiful flowers and I'm pretty sure I'll end up going back for a couple more. Let me know in the comments down below out of everything I showed you, what was your favorite item? And let me know what kind of cool items your Dollar Tree has right now. Because I'd love to check them out the next time I'm there. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.